We're here at the CES in Las Vegas, where technology is changing advertising. We're doing a series of video interviews with Video Amp, where we're talking to technologists and thought leaders about measurement, about attribution, and about data, and how they're revolutionizing advertising. Well, I think advanced TV is really bringing the targeting that is available in digital that's been so successful to the television landscape. And I think that is really what advertisers want. And frankly, increasingly, that's what the television stations and the television networks need in order to be successful as they compete with Facebook and Google. Absolutely. Uh, digital targeting is essential. If you think about it, if you drop anybody on this planet and you say, do I want to target somebody that's 18 to 49 or do I want to reach somebody whose lease is expiring in three months? You're going to want to reach somebody whose lease is expiring in three months every day of the week. And so in order for TV to be successful across every screen as that powerful brand building mechanism, they need to bring digital targeting into the landscape. The advertisers want standardized segments to be able to program across all platforms. And so I think the way that we need to start thinking about TV is video content and video advertising across all screens that's going to be sold in the future on an impression basis. And so you need standardization to do that. I think holistic uh, measurement and attribution is possible in certain instances and is going to be increasingly likely over time as television advertising is, becomes more addressable and as the technology to be able to measure based on outcomes becomes more prevalent. It is absolutely the wave of the future. It's unclear whether advertising is actually going to be purchased on outcomes or measured on outcomes, but it's absolutely going to be optimized on outcomes. The better question would be, why would age and gender, why would an 18 to 49 uh, target be thoughtful and appropriate to actually reach people when we can know so much more about them? There's so much waste involved, which isn't good for the advertiser and it's not good for the seller of the inventory. There's certain principles that I believe in talking to people in the landscape and being on the buy side for 14 years and building my own agency before coming to Comscore. I think undoubtedly advertisers are not going to accept uh, measurement that's not third party. And so I think C-Flight is actually a step in the right direction. It's more of a framework of how do you make sure that you are counting impressions cross-platform. But we're partnered within C-Flight and I think in, what you're going to see over time is third party measurement embedded in mechanisms where advertisers and sellers of media will be able to measure across screen.